Hey guys, this is Arnablus98 and welcome to my tutorial video for a little mini bone crusher from the first Transformers movie. This guy's a very simplified Transformer. He's kind of like a one step. He's, he's like a three step. He transforms in three steps, literally. And he's really simple. I showed him off at Brick Fair. No showcase video for him because he's really easy. And I'm, in case you're wondering, I did make a bone crusher back then. My first movie Transformer. He was also pretty simple, but this guy is just really dumbed down. Yeah, it's really easy, and you, yeah, you probably seen him at Brick Fair, and you got the chance to mess around with him. I did let kids mess with him, and he hasn't really fallen apart that much, unless you really tried to peel off pieces. And yeah, so I got some requests for instructions, and here's another video. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy it, and see. Um, I hope you can see all the parts clearly and stuff. I'm not sure if I'll do another instruction video for a while. I still get more. A uh, comment saying, uh, "Can you do tutorials and stuff?" Especially in my recently in my new uh, Western Star Prime instruction videos take a while, and you're probably wondering if you just get the LEDD file, but those are terribly confusing. When I tried to rebuild Hound, I kind of had a bit of trouble, and I made the instructions myself, so yeah, it kind of shows that. So um, instruction video for a while. I'm going off to college next Wednesday, and. I don't know, I might I might bring a few Transformers with me so I could just reverse engineer them for videos. Maybe an instructions video when I reach a thousand subs. I'm almost there, I think. Well, three-fourths away. Yep, so now on to the actual building. So here's part one of all the parts required. I took out all the tan pieces, well, minus these because they're kind of important. First, you got these the little round uh, things for the wheels. So you have eight of them. And these things might be a problem because I had a lot of these from the, the series uh, two mix, three Mixel, the tan ones, and they had tons of these, but those Mixels aren't around anymore, obviously, so a good substitution could be the droid arms, tan droid arms, or these in black or any other color works. And little Technic pins, um, these things, uh, bricks, tan stuff, two sets of clips, uh, a bunch of uh, brackets, two boat studs. And a pair of some studs here, just two one by two plates, a Travis brick for the head, and this piece here. And these clear pieces can be replaced by like a black one or anything. Yeah. And for ball joints, it's really easy because these ball joints are very common. I never use them on any of my official transformers. Well, maybe brawl, but it didn't turn out too well. So these are really easy. These make up the feet of like almost every mixel, and they're really easy. And so you need four of them. Doesn't matter what color combo. And you need one of these pe these three ball joints connected together. Once again, in some mixel sets, I don't know which ones that are out right now. And that should be it. Time for the mainly tan parts. Yeah. So here are all the tan parts. Um, as of this record time of the recording, I don't think there's that many good sets that have a good amount of tan. Like. Back when I started taking parts for uh, my Transformers, I used a lot of the Series 3 Mixels and the, um, the Chima Legends Beast, Legend Beast, like the Lion one, they have lots of tan parts. But then again, you probably have a lot in your collection, or you could replace some of the tan with some uh, dark dark uh, gray or black. It doesn't really matter, as long as it's not too obvious. Let's have a lot of these things. This is just a brick. Um, these slope pieces. A bunch of plates everywhere. Plates simple. Yeah, and that should be it. You can pause the video if you want to uh, make sure you have all the parts and let's get a uh, building.
Yeah, so now that you've assembled all these little pe parts, time to put everything together, and I apologize for the non-transformer music. First of all, this is main body, four ball joint sockets, each of the individual limbs plug into here. And in the video, I only showed building one arm and one leg, because I kind of got lazy, and plus, I'm pretty sure you're smart enough to just mirror the one to just mirror everything. And they all use the same parts, you know, especially angled stuff, like, yeah. There's his body and now for his backpack and his claw, this front grill part, and the claw attaches to the front wheels and windshield. This bracket will go right, right there. They all go together. And there you go, there's Bone Crusher. He's very simple, of course. And he's really simple to put together. He pulls together very well. Never did a full review on this guy. But yeah, there he is. He's ready to slide into a bus and tear up the entire freeway to get to Optimus. Yeah, and to transform him back, he's really easy. He folds in the hands. This is basically like the Legends toy, and it's like he transforms in like three steps. So, one, two, and three. Don't forget the heel spurs. And there you go. His claw can move around on a ball joint. Uh, it comes off sometimes. It doesn't, it doesn't touch the ground exactly. Well, unless you rotate this section. Yeah, there it goes. And I could flip some cars, like flipping hamburgers. <laughs> it's random. Yeah, he's a Buffalo Mine Clearing Vehicle. Just really easy to transform back to. He didn't even make the transformation sound while doing it. There you go. Easy. And you fill out the fingers too. Yeah, this is the end of this tutorial video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'd love to see you guys come up with. You could build this guy or, I don't know, you can make... Tons of other characters, the original creations. I can't think of any anybody that has these proportions and turns into a truck. I don't know. Oh, you can make him green. You can make his uh, uh, deep jungle version, like the toy. You can make a pink bone crusher if you want. I don't know. What else character could you make? This guy. Maybe Transformers Prime Breakdown if you're brave enough. Oh, wait, that's not going to work. I was thinking because the wheels are in the back, but never mind. His proportions are weird, his head position is weird. Bone crits are kind of a one of a kind, but I love to see what ideas you have come up with. <clears throat> and if you do build this guy, I love to see. You can post a link for for your video in the description. This is probably my last tutorial for a while since I'm going off to college next week on Wednesday. Don't worry, I still have more videos. I plan to showcase my newly improved movie Optimus Prime and I have a little vlog coming up. So yeah, this is Arnold's 98, and I gotta roll out. <laughs> yeah, terrible ending. Bye.